Hello my fluffy teddy bears and welcome to my channel. This is Solfrid from Green Bean Cottage and today I will be doing a regular tarot reading for you guys. A collective tarot reading. It's not an ASMR video. This is for my other channel that I haven't been posting to for very very long. But let's just see what's going on with some of you today shall we yeah i'm using my new tarot deck the illuminati tarot deck uh, i think it's something like that um i just picked one today uh so let's just try to tune in yeah to this i have been missing uh reading for you and yeah i'm just really just wanted to make a, a tarot reading for you guys i'm not even sure i want to call this fluffy teddy bears on this channel we'll see but have some time before I have to run out the door and we will do it yeah let's okay so what can we find out about our beautiful viewers today our amazing beautiful visitors on green bean cottage channel today who needs to hear this message and who is this for what can we find let's see Okay, we will do the, the oopsie oopsie. The some cars wanted to come a, come forward today, so we will do the, the, the Celtic Celtic cross. Is it that? And I'm just going to do like this and like this. Let's see if you can see here. I want you to be able to see. Hmm. I guess it will just have to be like this. Um, your situation. We have, you know, we have Queen of Swords here in the past. And Five of Swords here in the future. Um, in your current situation. Current situation, I just get the feeling of some. We have family here. Family, Ten of Cups. And then the Death card crossing it. So. I just get the feeling of. You might either be in a family union now, union now and there is something threatening to your family or there has been a, a separation or a divorce or something like that that it's this is like this, the death card is 
like the symbol of ending um, take it as it resonates so it could also be that something has affected your family right now something that is like I do get the feeling of like this happy family here but then this death card is like bringing it kind of down here in the past we have queen of swords um, and we have five of swords here in the future and down here in the conscious here it is like four of wands which is kind of uh, it can be like symbol of marriage I think union of some sort and then we have nine of wands here so there is something about you Maybe you want to get married, or you have met someone new, or you have a dream for the future about meeting someone. Um, and here, up in the conscious, nine of wands. Seems like there is some. You might feel a little bit cautious, protective. Uh, I don't know who Queen of Wands is. Is this you or like you can be a man or a woman, but is this like you in the past here? Maybe you focused a lot, lot about... Uh, I just get the feeling of there was a that this is like a strong person, intellectual, uh, maybe evolving in some kind of way here. Uh, taking new routes or new trying up new things. Or you might have like been very like into some uh, into the space of uh, maybe you are studying or having a business, been focusing on that. Here in the future, I see you walking away from something. Uh, with your head held high um, maybe something is over and you're going to try some there is a new chapter in your life um, right now here is you with a lot of many options you are standing in front of a lot of options here now uh, where to go from this might be something related to this family situation uh, or union of some sort uh, that is, has ended or something happened to it uh, and you really um, I actually have forgotten one card. We will just put it right here. So people might see you as like walking away from something. Uh, uh, 
emotionally uh, and you might maybe be scared of falling there might maybe be some worries involved uh, but at the same time you are ready to just take some chances and this is like how people see you kind of that you are walking away and you are just doing something new and that you might be a little bit like hmm does this person dare to take that step or not uh, will I will it looks like maybe you are afraid of falling hurting yourself in the process your hopes and dreams you just hope for the world kind of you know you just have dreams for the future you just want to be happy experience new things travel uh, be free uh, enjoy life and just explore as much or just taking as much as the, the life and the world can offer you um, the result prince of cups huh. hmm. well there might be someone this could be you or someone else and I just get the feeling that if this were you um, you are in a good place emotionally and just uh, doing your own thing and being more connected maybe with your feelings now than in the past or this could be someone coming into your life offering you something uh, maybe a new love new friendship it's a positive card from what I'm feeling right now so yeah um, everything is going to work out just fine and I'm still in the learning process of reading tarot and I didn't use any books today and I'm not going to do some follow-up follow up cards today um, just wanted to do some just quick and you know? I really don't really want to make it too specific I'm trying but it's not easy because I want to leave it up to you to fill out the missing pieces where it can resonate with you and maybe give you some inspiration of some sort without uh, without saying too much because uh, this is like kind of to get in touch with your intuition and your unconscious mind maybe get some new ideas that can help you al along the way maybe picking up some pieces here and there um, and Queen of Cups here I just get the feeling that you are a strong person and it's maybe time to focus more on feelings and your emotional life uh, it seems like you are well equipped uh, Um, in other areas kind of but um, seems like you deep deep down are like hoping for a maybe a, a love love or a deep deep connection with someone friendship or whatever whatever you feel 
might suit that card for you anyway thank you so much for watching this tired of breathing video i really want to make more videos in the future both on my i have you know sulfit asmr tarot channel and then i have this green bean cottage ch channel and i don't want to do tarot readings on my sulfit asmr channel because this is like I'm really interested in this and I want to like that therefore I made like a really dedicated channel ASMR channel for tarot but also I want to do more tarot readings on here uh, maybe next to other things but this is like what I'm interested in now like my green bean cottage is just a cottage full of my personal interests and who knows maybe it becomes a tarot channel or everything just related to tarot and all magical things mystical things and you know sulfur asmr is my main channel where i make asmr videos uh, you know i wouldn't mind making a as you know tarot reading there once in a while but you know i don't think my viewers are that into tarot readings uh, and I want my viewers to relax and some might find it disturbing to having to think about things and being told what's <laughs> uh, having to think about the meaning of the cards and their own life I don't know anyway I just wanted to to separate it um, so let me know in the comment below what you think about this tarot reading um i wish you a wonderful day or night take very very good care and goodbye Mwah.